awesome. It's such an incredible event. Fans in Mexico are just the best. <laughs> right? I'll say one of the... <laughs> Anything. That's how passionate they are. I think one of the things I really, <laughs> I really love about being here is the families that are here. You know, we see parents with their kids. It's a fam. Gaming is such a, a, a just an activity that brings people together. It's awesome to be here with so many families, having a great time. This is just what gaming should be about. So, I mean, obviously we hear you talk about you know, gaming for everyone and yeah. you know, we brought out the adaptive controller which was just something so incredible. I mean, that's only just you know, one small part of you know, gaming for everyone. What does the whole thing kind of mean to you in its bigger picture? You know, I love the art form of video games. I think we tell stories that bring people together. I think whether it's competing or whether it's cooperative, I think everybody should be able to play. You talked about the adaptive controller. It's awesome. We're launching the adapt controller in 17 new markets in 2019, wow. including here in Mexico, which is great. Because gaming is a great level, you know. It doesn't matter like what your physicality is. You can compete on an even playing field with everyone else. That's, That's amazing. Right. That's exactly right. Yeah. And you know, we want to make sure that the community is the right place for everybody. We want to make sure content's right for everybody. I think it's just, it's such a, and being here with the fans, you hear from them. We know gamers are passionate. <laughs> where do you see us in like 20 years time? Like sell us the dream. Where are we going to uh, go? Come on. I love on. that. I mean, you think about for us when we started on this journey a few years ago, we said, we want to make sure we've got the largest library of games for people to play. So we did things like backward compatibility. We did some work on our, our platform and our services, brought Mixer in. People told me, hey, I want better hardware. We went out and did S. We went out and did X, the most powerful console in the world, yeah. something we're committed to in the future. And we wanted to bring all gamers together regardless of what platform they're on. So we've That's been talking cool. about cross-play, cross-progression. We showed a little bit about xCloud in the future. But when I really look at Next, I think we got a ton of work to do on Windows. And yeah. Windows is something I'm very committed to. I've heard the feedback about our store. I'm going to take a much more, a bigger leadership role on what's going on with the Windows store, make it really tailored towards the gamers that we know want to see the best from what we have to offer. And I, it's going to be a fun journey. I'm loving all these big announcements for Game Pass. You're saying you're super committed to the service. This is how you see the kind of future going. Well, I would say it's about choice for gamers, right? Mm. So people want to buy games to build their library. That's their choice, and I love that. Kind of mixing up the genres as well. You might be like well into shooters, but actually you're like, oh, well, hey, it's not going to cost me anything. I'll just have a little dabble with that. That's the best thing. Like what we see when people get into Game Pass is they actually play more games. Okay, that's very, very exciting. Thank you so, so much for joining us, Phil. It's Thank a pleasure. You.